What's up guys, it's the how to guy one two three here and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to play um emulators on your iPod touch, iPhone and iPad, whatever um Apple device you use with a Wii remote right here that I got. Yeah, there we go. Um it's really easy and it's not any of that crap that you see on YouTube like how to put games on your Xbox where you take your games and you put it on your Xbox and it's something like that. I actually made a video like that on my main account. Um, please subscribe to that. It will be in the description below. And the reason why I haven't been making videos in a couple weeks is because I have been um, doing a lot to that my main channel. So yeah, check that out. So um, let's get started. You do need a jailbroken iPod for this, so sorry about that. So then you're going to just want to go to Cydia. And then you're going to need to add a source. So just go to Manage Sources. Then you're going to need to add a source by going to Edit, Add, and the source will be in the description. I actually have it right here. So I'll show you that. So it'll be in the description, like I said. Right there, the apt.xsoes.com. That will be in the uh, description, like I said before. And then go to search, zoom out there, and then type in S N E S, and then search. It takes a long time. And then find this one right here, S N E S A dot D dot X plus. Um, it should have the X Series logo right there. You see, and then just install that. Then when you're done that, you're gonna need to put Bluetooth on. And if you don't know how to do that, I'll show you. Just go to settings. Go to general. Bluetooth and on. Actually, I have mine off. Actually, no, it's on, but I have another app sort of controlling it. So, I don't know. But, yeah. So, um, then, uh, once you're done that, you're going to want to go to the app we just downloaded in Studio. Mine's in my game folder. All the way at the bottom. And then, now, this is where we want to hook up our Wii Remote. So, you're going to have, want to have your Wii Remote here. Just because you're going to need to press some buttons in a sec. You're going to want to, here I'm just going to turn the Wii Remote off. So then, turn Wii Remote on. And then hit 1 and 2. It's already connecting because it recognizes it. But then it's going to ask you to press 1 and 2 together. So you just press 1 and 2. And it's going to start to read it like this. And then mine's already connected. So then when you're done, hit, um, then just hit there when it's unsyncing. And then, um, if you don't have any games, just go find games and you can find a couple. I have three. I have Mortal Kombat, Super Mario Kart, and, um, Mario, Super Mario World. So, I'm just going to show you this. So, let's just get my Wii remote. And just... Okay, let's see. Yeah, let's move this back a little Whoa, don't want my camera to fall. Okay, so, we're just going to press... One. I'm not sure if you can see that. But yeah, you see, kind of controlling it. With my Wii remote. Here, I'll do another example right here. So I'll okay, guys. Um, here's a little demonstration. I kind of put it on my phone so you can kind of see a little bit of it. It's still kind of like hard to see, but show you. A demonstration you can kind of see the arrow move. You see, I'm using the arrow keys, or not the arrow, it's like the plus on the Wii remote. And then if I press one, I'm playing, by the way, I'm playing Super Mario Kart. And then let's just play whatever that is Mario Kart GP DX Labs, one player. And let's play them. Let's be, let's be Yoshi. She's cool. 
and then there's also some arrow keys you can kind of see there on the iPod if you don't have a Wii remote, but the Wii remote is way better. Okay. Oh yeah, but and I think I already mentioned this before, but uh, you can down yeah I did, but you can download games like this. See, I'm driving. A second Mario Kart. For some reason, I didn't actually buy this for the Wii. You know, it was like the best for the Wii because I played it. And this game's kind of like like the map, like this first map, is real easy. And kind of see a move thing. Okay, that's enough. So guys, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and um, see you guys later.